Now, during the summer, people get busy with camps, vacations, and other activities. That means less time for people to donate blood. On tonight's Health Beat, Kelly and Sophie Heineman takes you to a local blood drive that couldn't have come at a better time. To meet the community's needs, Executive Director Ken Versteeg says the community blood bank needs at least 100 donors a day. But with fewer blood donations during the summer, he says the need for donations right now is huge. They're busy taking vacations, they're busy with ball games. Uh, they forget about the need for blood. And the need for blood in our community is extremely high because we continue to grow here in Sioux Falls. That's why blood drives like this one with Siouxland Oral and Maxillofacial Surgery are so important. And we're very community service oriented. And what a lot of people don't know about oral surgeons, it's oral and maxillofacial surgery, so we do a lot of facial trauma for both hospital systems. And we see the need for blood in a lot of the trauma patients that we service. This is the second time the dental office is hosting the blood drive. Last year's drive helped 123 people. Oral and maxillofacial surgeon Dennis Miller says this year they're hoping to raise that number. Yeah, about half of our employees uh, qualify for giving blood for a variety of reasons, so we have a, a lot of employee input as well. And after doing a good deed, donors will receive a goodie bag, a free meal, and even a coupon for some free ice cream. I think if people are going to take part of their day or part of their lunch and donate some blood, you know, they deserve something for that. But if you didn't make it to this blood drive, Versique says you can still donate. You'll either log on to our website at CB lifeblood.org or people can just walk into our donor rooms. We have a donor room at Sanford in the main lobby of the hospital or we have a donor room over at Avera McKinnon in Plaza 2. With Elfbeat, I'm Sophie Heineman. Herstig says another option for people interested in donating blood is going to a blood mobile. To find out where they are parked, go to this story on kelloland.com.